This is CBS 2 News at 5. You know, sometimes we take friendships for granted, but for kids with disabilities, it's even easier to be left out. Now, a new program at One North Suburban Middle School is changing that one friend at a time. Roseanne Tejas has the story of the Nora Project. These fourth graders greet their friend Finn with smiles and high fives. He and Connor are part of a project that connects children with mental and physical disabilities <laughs> with buddies, in this case at Sunset Ridge Middle School in Northfield. Think about what's the same about you and the person with a disability. Each encounter, like this bowling outing with Connor, <laughs> a lesson in empathy. It all started with a simple request from Amanda Martinson's cousin after she got news that her tiny baby Nora had suffered brain damage during surgery. As she was crying to me and just pouring her heart out, one of the things she said was that she was really scared that Nora was going to grow up not having friends. Nora's project connects the children. Good job, Finn. The children do the rest. He just like us. He loves learning and he can pick things up so quickly. Focusing on their similarities, not their differences, even making documentaries about their new friend and interviewing their parents. He's very loving. What are your thoughts when you see the kids interacting? It's so heartwarming. The lessons on this playground come easy. Acceptance, kindness, and empathy through fun and friendship. And when he was leaving, he actually started to cry because he did not want to leave <laughs> at all. Good sign. Yes, that's a good sign. As the yearbooks are signed and the school year comes to a close, these kids are going home with new friends and new attitudes. The goal now to put Nora's project in as many schools as possible in Northfield. Roseanne Teus, CBS 2 News. Wow. What a great story. The Nora Project plans to reach more than 30 schools next year. And you can learn more by going to our website, cbschicago.com.